Salutations friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be reviewing Fig Tea from Parfums de Nicolai. So if you'd like to know what I think about this fragrance, then keep watching. If you hear a little scritchy scratchy in the background, I don't know if you guys know, we just adopted three additional cats, so that makes eight cats in this household. And the three kittens are playing in the other room and they can be quite loud. So if you hear a little pitter patter of kitten feet, I'm sorry if it's distracting. But anyway, Fig Tea from Parfums de Nicolai. This is a fragrance that I tried a few months ago when I was at Osme with Lola and Tina, and I adored this scent. So for transparency purposes, I bought this. I paid for this. So this was not, there's the pitter patter. This was not given to me to review. This is a purchase that I made after sampling it because I loved it. Now the notes in this are figs, osmanthus, divana, and tea. And the tea kind of smells similar to like a green tea in fragrances like Elizabeth Arden green tea or Eau de Verte from Bulgari. Now what I love about this fragrance is the fact that it doesn't come off overtly fig and it doesn't come off overtly tea. The osmanthus and divana really help to bridge those two notes and help them blend really beautifully together. It's a very kind of milky but ultra sweet fig. So it's not going to be more of a green watery fig. It's definitely a sweet kind of candied fig. But I think the tea and the osmanthus really helps balance that out. I find this fragrance to be really refreshing and a little bit juicy, which is saying something about a fig tea, but I also find this to be a perfect fragrance to wear in high humidity. If you like to smell really beautiful and youthful, I think that there's something about this scent that just really works in Florida weather. So if you live in a high humidity, hot area and you're looking for a beautiful new fragrance to wear, this is fantastic. Now I could be, incorrect and I'm all I'm off and am so please correct me if I'm wrong but I do believe this fragrance was released in the year 2000 or in the early 2000s so this fragrance has been around for a while and I must say that Parfums de Nicolai is an underappreciated house in the fragrance community all of the fragrances from that line I've tried I absolutely genuinely adored and I can see myself purchasing all of them that was a kitty butt <laughs> A kitten over here or a giant cat that's named the kitten <laughs> um so i definitely want to explore this house more and give this house more appreciation i also really like the price point of this house as well for being a really beautiful high quality juice with absolutely exceptional presentation it's one of the more affordable niche uh, niche houses on the market this comes in two sizes a hundred mil or 30 mil a hundred mil I believe is 145 and 30 mil is $48 so it's really affordable in regards to other niche fragrances out there so I definitely recommend jumping into this house and really checking out this entire line because they are incredible now when it comes down to longevity and projection of this fragrance i think it performs very well on my skin i get about six to eight hours which is saying something because again i live in the tropics a projection of this fragrance for the first few hours is about moderate a little bit past arm's length and then it becomes a little bit more intimate the last two to three hours of the lifespan of this scent now this is a candied, sweet, youthful scent, but I do find this fragrance to be very unisex. Fig is one of those fruity scents that I think works beautifully on men and women. And whether or not I think fruity scents should be worn by men or women, fragrance is genderless. You can wear whatever you want, whenever you want. It doesn't matter. But I find this scent, I've smelled this on men and it just smells really freaking good on guys. I love fig on men. And I also think that this smells really nice on women as well. I think it smells amazing on me. So I definitely am excited for this. It's been a recent favorite in my collection. I'm so happy I picked up a bottle of it. And I've been wearing it so much. I'm wearing it today and I bathe in this. I absolutely love it. So that is my review of Fig Tea from Parfums de Nicolai, and I hope you like this review. If you guys have any experience with this house or this fragrance, good or bad, if you tried it and you like it, or if you tried it and you don't like it, let me know in the comment section below. I love to know what you guys think. And I like people coming to these reviews and also reading the comments and getting a good idea of what other people have to say about this fragrance rather than just my own opinion. Because do remember, these reviews are my opinions. What works good on me and what I think is an amazing fragrance doesn't necessarily think that, doesn't necessarily, there we go, 
doesn't necessarily mean that you guys will think that and you guys are the authority and know more about what smells good on you than I do. So definitely get a good idea of what other people say and don't just take my word for it because I am an amateur and you guys know way more than I do in most cases, specifically what works good on your skin. But I do absolutely love this scent and I, I love it, it's so good. So thank you guys so much for tuning into this review. If you like reviews like this, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. It lets me to continue doing videos like this. If you do not like videos like this, there is a thumbs down button. That lets me know to curate the type of content that you guys like to see. So a thumbs up for yes and a thumbs down for no. I have no problem with thumbs down or downvotes, guys. It really helps me out in deciding what type of content to bring you guys. Don't forget to subscribe. I love to see this channel grow. And don't forget to click the little bell to be notified when I have new content. As always, guys, I hope you're all happy and healthy and have a great day, month, year, whatever, and I will see you next time. Bye!